you guys know yesterday was Palm Sunday so if you might remember usually at Sunday church we grab palm leaves like all of us the children and youth we grab palm trees and we wave them throughout the church and it kind of makes me sad that we miss that so we are instead going to make our own palm trees and you can wave them around so that's the craft for today and Vivian will be helping me make this let's go Okay, so there are two ways of doing this. So Vivian is gonna do one and I'm going to do the other. What supplies you're gonna need today is you're gonna need some scissors, some tape, round construction paper, and green construction paper. And Vivian, can you go get a pencil too? Cause you're gonna need a pencil too. So the first thing you can do, so you'll separate, if you're doing this with other people, like Vivian, I'm gonna give her some green paper and I'm gonna have some green paper and we each get a brown. Got it? Yep. All right. So, Vivian is going to be on her green paper tracing out her handprints. So that's what she's gonna do. So if you wanna do that, you can do that. And on mine, I'm going to draw a big oval. So let's give it a try. Okay, so Vivian just finished drawing her hands. You might be able to see them. I don't know, the light is weird in here. Anyway, she finished drawing her hands. I had her draw six of them. And then I drew two ovals, which you can only do one if you want, it's up to you. So next up, we have to cut out our shapes. So go ahead and do that. Okay, so Vivian and I finished cutting out our shapes. So if you are doing the oval one, like me, your next step is you get to pick which spot, this spot is the bottom. So this is the bottom for me, it's right here. And then you're just gonna cut slits, like just like this, up the side. Do as many as you want, as deep as you want, just cut those up both sides. You can do it on both of them if you're doing two, it's up to you. And um, people who do their hands, you can sit and relax during this part. Okay, so I finished cutting out mine, so I see it kind of bends, like you can see a little bit. Next step, both, both styles, you're going to need this piece of paper. And what you're going to do is you're going to cut out what looks like a trunk, if that makes sense. So you're just going to draw like a straight line and cut it out. That's it. Okay, this next step, so you're going to need all your pieces and your tape. So, for these people, what you're going to do is you're going to take one side and you're going to take this and you're going to put it right um, here. Did it pause? Nope, it's good. You're going to take it right here. Sorry, my phone's on low battery mode while I'm recording. That's what she asked. Um, so you're going to take it right here and you're just going to tape this on. So you have a little piece at the bottom that's long enough, but you want to tape the rest so it doesn't move too much. All right, go ahead and do that. While these people, so you have a bit more fun tasks. So you have this, Vivian, can you hold that up for me? Yep, and you are going to tape all of your hands to the sides like this. That's why I had, had her do six, so it'll look like these down the side. So that's what Vivian's will look like. So go ahead and take care of that. Okay, and you should have your palm branches now. So this is what mine look like. They're like this. This sort of looks more like the one you have at home, but this one's more fun. You want to show them yours, Vivian? Okay. Yeah. Well, with Vivian's, we can probably tape hers down more, so it'll stay better next time. And so it'll stay while you wave it around. But now you can walk around your house waving it like you would at church, which is one of the things I wanted to do today. So let's bow our heads and pray. Ready? Dear Jesus. Thank you so much for coming and celebrating with us. Um, we're sad that we couldn't celebrate you at church and remember this glorious day where people paraded and laid down these palm branches in front of you as you walked through, well, rode through on your donkey. But we're thankful that we have crafts that are able, that allow us to celebrate at home today. So keep us safe. And all God's children said, amen. All right, have a great week.